Do you know what the parasympathetic system is, and what is it responsible for? Also called the rest and digest, and part of the autonomous nervous system, it is crucial for the health and human well-being. That is why, today we gonna dive into the subject, and I'll try to bring light on, it so you can better understand how the body works, and what to do to function better. Coming right up. I am Mihai Dumitrescu, IPT skill enhancement trainer, pro basketball coach, and NCSF certified sports nutrition specialist, and I welcome you to our channel. The parasympathetic nervous system is the automatic part of the brain, which brings everything to balance by regulating all the processes behind our control, as you'll see in the following. Before I'll go into its role, I want to mention that the opposed system called the sympathetic nervous system, or fight flight, which was the subject of another video I've made, can't function at the same time. The best comparison is with the car pedals, which cannot work at the same time, as you need to step off the acceleration if you want to step on the brake pedal. Same here, sympathetic which is the emergency system, needs to stop, so the parasympathetic to kick in. Follow the link in the description to watch our video about the fight-flight system, if you want to understand both. When the parasympathetic system becomes dominant the body slows down, the blood is sent to the vital organs, the heart and breathing are slowed down, the muscles are relaxed, and vasodilation is produced. The four main processes 100% controlled by this system are, digestion, immune function, anabolism, and reproduction, and I'll expand on the subject more. The digestion process is fully coordinated by the parasympathetic system, and this includes the hydrochloric acid and enzyme production which are needed for the food to break down into nutrients, the bowel movement so the digestion can move from one stage to another, and lastly, the absorption, which is the transfer of the nutrients into the blood. Even if a person eats correctly, if this system is not fully activated, less than 50% of the food will be utilized, which will finally result in heartburn, indigestion, constipation, and malabsorption, leading in time to malnutrition. The immune function is mediated by the parasympathetic system, and it is the part that fights against the infections, and foreign invaders of the body. When the body cannot fight properly against those things, will get cold or flu, infections, or other damages from viruses or bacteria. When the body is under the stress of any nature, mental, physical, or nutritional, those things are likely to happen, as the body is under the sympathetic system's control. Another role of the rest and digest system is anabolism. Maybe you've heard this term, and you are familiar with it. Anyway, anabolism is the process of building things up, opposite to catabolism which breaks it down. Part of the anabolic process is the growth of anything in the body, repair of all that is damaged, and any form of healing that takes place. The opposed things that can happen are wasting of resources, atrophy of muscles, organs and in general any tissue, slow healing, or worst, no healing at all. The last process we'll go through is reproduction. It is all about fertility, libido, or erectile function, and when things go wrong, all of the contraries will take place, sterility, low sex drive, and erectile dysfunction. It is very important to understand that stress and especially long-term or chronic stress turns on the sympathetic and shuts down the parasympathetic nervous system, which will affect all of the processes I've described in this video, and in the end, the health and the life quality will be largely affected. Unfortunately, modern life is mostly dominated by stress, starting with nutrition, the chemical part, and ending with the emotional one, as a big part of our daily activities, and this is why digestion is poor, immune function is low, and the anabolic system is slowed down, and reproduction is highly affected. In the end, you'll be considered sick, when one of the symptoms of those problems will occur, but, in fact, this is just a signal of the body that something goes wrong and it must change. Contrary to what the organism demands, you'll be rewarded with drug treatments that will only hide the symptoms, and the damages will continue day after day. Good nutrition with whole foods, breathing exercises, yoga, meditation, along with daily movement or aerobic exercises, which can be also complemented by strength training should be the answer to all the problems of modern societies, and then most of our health-related issues will disappear and our lives will flourish day by day. In the end, I want to emphasize the importance of switching from the sympathetic to the parasympathetic system for a basketball athlete, which is crucial for growth, 
repair, and recovery in sports performance. Take a look at this video, so you'll understand how we advise our players to do all of these, and make it part of your daily routine. Hope you've enjoyed our video, so please give us a thumb up, and if you haven't done it yet, please subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell, so you'll not lose anything that will boost your career.